Alright guys, this will actually be the final video, is what it's looking like. They, they hit me with an okie doke, they Elden ringed me, whatever you want to call it. But, uh, here we are, once again, I still got the guys here. I just had to change back to the original fit to end it off. But that being said, if I beat him on this first attempt, verified, like, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell for future videos. And without further ado, let's fight my homeboy Kenshi. I'm at, uh, coming for the algorithm as well. Yeah, yeah. And we're just all chatting, playing different stuff. And I was like, let me finish this series off with the fellas. Oh shit! That oh shit sounds very promising. Bitch. All right. First things first, I'm putting the ominous chill back on my fucking move set because that lightning one ain't it. Oh, you hopping off, Josh? GG's. GG's, guys. Yo, everyone, thank you guys so much for coming to the stream today. Shout out to the newest members of the village, and that's gonna be, um, what's it called? Just, let me see. Art the Clown Fan, Shadow Wolf 6472. Thank you guys so much for the follows. You guys are absolute legends. Please feel free to join the Discord. Also, I hope you guys enjoy the Furiums in the future and enjoy the community and everything. And I hope you guys all have a fantastic and amazing rest of your guys tonight. Also, shout out to the people that sent raids our way tonight, and that's Nasty Mac TV. Um, <laughs> Dan Green and Vito, thank you guys so much. You guys are awesome. I appreciate you guys. That being said, I love y'all. Next time on Jazzy Boys Street. I wish you would have said that. Too. <laughs> but, alright guys, I'll catch you all later. Alright, everyone. Yeah, man. Alright, let's talk shit. <laughs> nah. Well, it seems like Master Duel is really pressing Jazzy, bro. Okay, look, here's the thing Jazzy goes into it expecting Yu Gi Oh to be exactly how it was. When we played it 20 years ago. Yeah, like. When we played it 20 years ago, holy fuck, shut up. <laughs> No, that's exactly that's that's the exact same phrase he, he that's the exact same phrase he used. Yeah. And it's like I get it, but at the same time, you go changed and like the thing is with me, like he literally changed me for OC Gang and I was like, dude. <laughs> 
it, it can feel good when it's done right. It's, it, it, it feels very satisfying when it happens. When I do it, you know? Yeah. I mean, it feels. It also feels really good to, you know, have a well-meaning duel. Like, you and your opponent are going back and forth, negating each other, you're destroying cards, you're trading life. It feels good doing that, too, because that's a hard-earned win or loss. Like, do I agree that Yu-Gi-Oh! changed? Yes. Do I agree it changed for the worst? Honestly, yeah. I do. I do, I do kind of think that, because it, it does kind of take out some strategy. But that's also just my opinion. Mm -hmm. Do I still find it fun? Yeah, I mean, I run the decks I want to run. Yeah, you know. A little that simple. I mean, when it comes to, like, how I play, I don't use any of the meta cards, like Maxi or Ash Blossom. I don't use any of those. Because, you know, I, I just don't want to. I want to continue to have fun, whether I win or lose, because it's not about winning. It's just, again, about having fun and enjoying the game I used to play. John remembers those days. We'd play with all of his cards. Me, your mom, and his girlfriend at the time. He dueled all three of us at the same time. Swept us. They were trying to jump me. <laughs> <laughs> the pause to let everything marinate sense me, bro. But yeah, like that was. I just, I just imagined Don with like Yugimoto hair. <laughs> going. I felt like I did at that moment. I, I felt like I. <laughs> <laughs> again, I like, it's like I said. It's like I enjoy it. You know, he he, he enjoy he he enjoys it, but he won't admit it. And it's like I have two decks that that have the possibility to OTK. Okay. They're not always going to, but they have the possibility to. Yes. Three actually, I think about three. But come on, come on, I got this, I got this. Do you want to take a guess as to what those three are, Chad? The danger deck. The danger deck's the one that has a possibility. It, it's okay. just I have to get really lucky. Your dark magician deck. Bitch. Then maybe your six samurai. Deck. Nope. I don't play. I haven't played this good deck against you. Because I, I, even though I really enjoy it, uh, my um. Oh fuck! Oh, that was close. Ooh. All right, uh, let me see what's happening, guys. Sorry for the delay, but he, this bitch is over now. I, I got his move sets. What was Zoe say? Like, like the song, the melody. I got a score. Yeah, that's what it is. I got the score down. Sure, it's a rap now. <laughs> uh, if it loads my, me in, oh shit! It's uh, anyways, Trent. It's my um, Galaxy Eyes deck. Oh, oh! <laughs> You're making me viscerally angry. Angrier, kitchy. All right, all right. Right away, are you good? Uh, so, aside from going to that function today, um, I went to a job interview to a staffing agency. Well, uh, oh shit. Oh shit. Oh yeah, shit. Uh, I like how he brings out a new move as soon as I say that shit. <laughs> He's like, yeah, you got to be. <laughs> yeah, you got my ass. Oh, yeah, that was the shit the Taos does. I didn't know he yeah, could do that. I forgot we are on YouTube. My mistake. Fuck! Well, Trent, looks like I'm back to calling you tomorrow again. Calling me tomorrow? Mm-hmm. I don't get it. Remember, I, I said that I'm gonna give you a call tomorrow? And you better uh, pick up? I probably won't. Damn! Get fucked. <laughs> That's what Trent told you. I'm about to beat this dude's ass, bro. He's starting to piss me off a little bit, but I'm keeping it. Oh, shit.
Alright then. Then it's gonna be then it's gonna be a dick. The biggest one. Yeah, bitch. When you have don't you when you need to have one verse? I mean, I sound more qualified you to, than you to have one. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, we're like girl moves to make all the boy moves go whack. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I guess it's more on the lines of, you know, for, for, for them, mine's a mystery, for yours it's a disappointment. I mean, if that's not below the belt, it's always gonna be a disappointment. Oh my god. Oh gosh, I you could I kinda have ex I kinda have expected Don to go sir <laughs> speak for yourself. That's how you know he's that's how you know he's locked he's, he's locked. locked. He's, he's focusing right there. He's he's channeling his uh Jimi Hendrix. Oh fuck! All right, no, nah, I'm good. I'm chilling. Deflect, bro. You you can't hit me with the same shit no more. You can't do it, bro. I'm on your that fucking sounded bumper. That sounded personal. I'm on your ass. Uh, it is getting late for me. I gotta go to bed. I'll talk to y'all. I'll talk to y'all later. Already well. Hey yo. Y'all better like, you better make sure you like and subscribe and hit that bell for notifications. Oh, Got oh, for the oh. You know the deal. Bro. Hey, did I, did I unlock Ultra Instinct just now? Like, what the fuck Do is it. going on? Think of it like this, guys. The sooner you sub, the sooner you can count him as one of his, as one of his first subscribers, right? So when he gets big, you, you got that, you got them bragging rights with him. 100%. That day one, mm hmm. Okay, got a real one. You too, dog. Appreciate Bye, that. I got you. Bye, YouTube. Yeah, yeah. I'm eating, I'm eating that. I don't know if he can't punk you no more, bro. Bitch. Let's go. Nah. Let's go. Let's go, let's go! Oh 
my fucking god, bro. That doesn't sound good. No. He held you in there, didn't he? Yeah, he was like a fucking sliver. A fucking sliver, Trent. I'm on this fucking bumper. Fuck that. Fuck that. I ain't even prepping. I got the game plan. My dragon's almost full. Like, if I would have lasted like five more seconds, I would have been able to pop the dragon and secure the dub. But he, like, hesitates sometimes. Like, sometimes it's, like, shorter or longer when he releases one of his charge moves and it'd be fucking with me. Mm. Just, like, he throws, like, he, um, he throws, like, feints and stuff. Mm hmm. Feints and pickouts. I just gotta be patient. Mm -hmm. Let the battle come to you. Did I die? Yeah, I fucking died. See, playing so fucking patient is against my nature, though. Like, nigga, I'm on people's head. Hold on. You gotta be in there to get it, bro. <laughs> I have to mix in a little bit of both. It's a little risky. But I did better last match than the one I just had because I was playing like me. I just a little more tentative, but don't just change my whole play style. All right, all right, I'm on this. Depending on what's his first move, though, it's gonna be annoying. Oh, I know that one. I know that one. Let's go.
bitch. I'm gonna beat this dude ass track. <laughs> Let me see, let me see. What's your first move gonna be? This time, oh, this is the dash, I'm gonna be on you at the start, bro. Oh, is it anything else? Hmm. Depends on what the anything else is. So this is the earth move, it's kind of annoying. Oh, the fire. Let me do this shit. I want to jump on chart. I really do. <laughs> Fuck. Nah, nah. I got this. 1v1. 1v1. I beat the dragon 1v1. Eventually, my teammates got murked pretty easily. I'm the hero. I got this. Yeah, I usually don't get this frustrated. This game is been oh. Let's go.
Damn. Let's go. We locked in, Trent. You got this, bro. Let's go! Ominous chill. Let's go! Dub City. Another one? Making right. bitches out of here. Making bitches out of here. Oh, that's actually kind of tragic inside, actually, what this is going on. Got the dragon now. <sighs> Fuck you, Taos. I could not let my ancestry, the clan that bears the dragon's <laughs> elixir field, become known. And so. I sealed off my eyes and the terrible power within them. Mm. Hugh G drained my body's energy in his effort to create an ultimate elixir. However, I resisted <coughs> and prevented his dark power from controlling me totally. It was my belief in you that allowed me to do this. Seeing you bravely fight on. Never losing faith in your allies for a moment has given me the courage to now open my eyes. Oh, shit. What's going on with your eyes, bud?
Oh shit, a lot of stuff's going on. Aim north. Fire! I see our men are well trained, Gong Jin. My lord, I assure you, the enemy shall rest upon the riverbed. <sighs> on to the next target! Father, brother, oh man, bear witness upon me for the future of the Swen clan. Finally, we're going to the cell. It seems peace is not that far. That said, the recently appointed Sumayi seems to be highly regarded. A forbidden power. They're showing all of it. Huh. Well, that might be the end of the game, guys. Let's see what's going on after these fucking cutscenes. Oh, credits. Oh, another cutscene. You're leaving. Blindfolded you. that needs quelling. Will you be coming? I will stay here. With these eyes that discern fate, I must forge the next era. Oh, they showing his eyes. Hmm. Is he Zhuge Liang? We haven't met Zhuge Liang in the story yet? Or in the story at all? No, I think the blindfolded boy is Zhuge Liang. Because he just had a fan in his hand just now. Mm. So he did suddenly sprout a goatee, which I found was weird. But I guess that was after the top skip back there. But I think they showed the little battle chibi. Mm -hmm. And I think they showed that. And they showed that last campaign against Shu and way and they had somebody on a fan you couldn't see him but his hand dropped ever so slightly and people ran to check up on him i think he, oh man the yeah, dlc's gonna be nuts if they make you choose a side i hope they don't force you like i hope there's two different options he's saying that it's more replayability but hold on Sacred Lotus, okay. This place was once bare, genuine and soon. Oh man, hold on. Let me 
See, the blacksmith got something new for me. I could use some more sleep. She could just use some more sleep. Okay. And let me see. The feature under battle preparation has been unlocked. Enter discipline. to do other stuff but make it so your morale can't be so high I guess better stuff drops when an enemy's morale is higher than yours hmm that's interesting travel unlock the difficulty rising dragon this can be changed via change difficulties this raises the enemy's maximum morale rank and increases mission difficulty while also making it easier to obtain five star items and equipment with new special effects. Oh, and they have plenty of... Huh. <coughs> okay, guys, um, I guess this is it. Wait, hold on. Let's see... When you die while the divine beast god just full ying long will revive you when you activate some should be second air. Second area that's Ying Long plus stone damage to your weapon it increases these. Oh, it's a stone type? Hmm. I, I don't. Documents. Ain't long. Alright guys, it's been a pleasure. This is actually the end to my first YouTube playthrough of anything. So I'm really actually hyped to see how this turns out when it's all said and done. That being said, if you did want to see more side content, I'm probably going to play and beat everything. But that won't be for the channel. Some of y'all might not vibe with it. But if you do, drop some comments about it. Like, if you want to see it, I'll show y'all. But that being said, it's been a wonderful playthrough. Appreciate all the views and the support. If you like and subscribe, that's even more, and I'd appreciate it even more. But y'all have a good one. Don't say to die. Has beaten Wolong. What a time.